Hello friends, welcome back. It is a wonderful day today out here on the estate and we are, well, let's say I am, cause I'm the only one out here. My husband's already did his heavy lifting, but we are, I am <laughs> planting in the orchard today. As you may have seen before in other videos that we have two orchards, the East West Orchard and the West Orchard, this orchard right there, <coughs> right there, excuse me, is fully grown. Very, very, very much grown. And over there, there's apple trees, pear trees, um, apple trees, pear trees, muscadine vines, and walnut trees, and pecan trees. Well, over here, where there's smaller trees, you can see my little station, to to the uh i guess right of it we have a pomegranate tree that i just planted over there is another peach tree and here we have let's go right here we have a fig tree that i'm going to plant right there is a pear tree then we have two apple trees right there so yeah we are underway for the new orchard we are going to plant some um, grape vines over here. I'm thinking table grapes, uh, like a Concord and a few muscadines. But of course I have to figure out how to create a structure. I'm pretty sure I'll find something on YouTube, but I have to create a structure to do that. But anyways, I just wanted to pop on here y'all so y'all can see what's been going on. Uh, not that much has been going on on the estate because we did get hit with COVID. Our whole household had got hit with COVID. So it took a while for us. And then we've been vacationing, which we're gonna be vacationing again soon. Um, but things have been going good. Things have been going good. All of the boys are just growing. Yep. But uh, <laughs> we, are, we are just, we're just enjoying being out here and enjoying our life uh lots of ups and downs lots of learning lots of lots and lots of learning because having an estate is definitely much bigger than what we've ever had and lived on our entire life so yeah but i wanted to just grab this picture well not grab this picture i wanted to get this video so that you guys could just plant with me Plant the new orchard with me. All right, let's go.
are completely finished. All of the trees are planted. Of course, I gotta do some deep watering uh, and I would prefer to do it right now because I don't want to be freezing at night. Right now we're getting up to about 40 something, 40, 50 degrees at night, which is still not bad, but it's very chilly. So I wanna, of course, uh, make sure that I'm warm when I'm doing it. So I'm gonna more than likely get that watering done in a few minutes. I uh, showed you guys those fish because as you have seen in my previous fo uh, videos, that I like to use fish as my food because trees need lots of food. And in this fall winter season when they're going dormant and they're, where their foliage and everything is going dormant and their roots are growing deep, um, I really wanna make sure that their roots are well fed since I do have five kids. It is very hard sometimes to keep a good schedule when it comes down to uh, orchard care and maintenance. So that is my solution. I follow a few YouTubers online and they are they have shown pretty much um, uh, success really when it comes down to using fish. So I get those fish from a bait shop. I get them completely free. I got, I have three cups of them uh, and I really didn't estimate how frozen they were. That's why you probably saw me go back and forth with those fish or trying to hack, uh, hack cut with the shovel, the fish. But uh, if you do try that method, try first your local bait shops and just see if they have some fish, some dead fish, not fish that are alive. No, no those fish were alive. Uh, no fish were harmed in the, <laughs> no live fish were harmed in the filming of this video. But uh, see if they have some dead fish for you that you could possibly have. Uh, you really wouldn't need as many as I did. I actually overestimated. So I have some dead fish uh, still to get rid of and I'm more than likely going to use them in uh, my landscaping and more than likely uh, in the vegetable garden back that way. So, but yeah, thanks so much for planting with me and joining me as I uh, replant our West Orchard. Uh, this was fun. Uh, I am going to get some watering on and I am going to mulch around these trees. I'm gonna cut a good barrier around all of the trees. I'll definitely show you guys that, uh, that final video or that final photo of what everything looks like. But until next time, y'all, see you soon. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.